Hello, and welcome to the spew. I am Ego Rambo Regnabo, and with me is Caliban Tibia Hi. and Anthropy. How's it going? And we are flags and sparklers. Woohoo! Anyway, so we are celebrating 4th of July. Even though we are immigrants, we are very grateful for being in America. So we are going to tell you today why we are grateful and about all the interesting history of the 4th of July. So, we'll start with Caliban, and it's only, oh, my sparkler died. Here, I put it out. Don't burn my yes. Yeah, no. Please don't burn my wiener. Although, I would not. I'm not making fire anymore. Yeah, I know, we'll take that in. Well, Ow! no surprise for you. My, my wiener is sparkling now. Ow! Anyway, okay. So, anyway, welcome to the spew. So, Caliban, um, what is your favorite thing about the Independence Day? Well, my favorite thing is, it's independence, it's freedom, which means that I can masturbate all I want to. Hear, hear! Tell that to Pee Wee Herman, he needed to wait till the 4th of July to whack off a movie theater. That's just true. Anyway, oh, my favorite thing about Independence Day is I think it's nice that only in America they celebrate when people have to wear, like adults have to wear diapers and their independence and it's embarrassing most of the time, but so to make it less embarrassing, they they go ahead and... Uh, what? Um, what I, don't, I don't think that's quite right. Oh. You, Caliban, what do you think? No. It, it's Independence Day. Oh, yeah, not that. Independence Day. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I like what he said is freedom is good stuff. Dudes. Okay. So, Entropy, what do you like about Independence Day? Oh, I, I like the history of it. See, uh... Way back in uh, 1482, Columbus came over and he gave the Indians smallpox so we could steal fireworks from the Chinese. Oh, yeah. yeah. What? I thought that was Leif Erikson that did that. Yes. I could be wrong. No, he was a singer in the 70s. Oh, yeah, you're right. And he sucked. He sucked bad. Until he became a Viking. Then he was cool. Yes. yes. He traveled back in time to do that. Oh, wow. He was much more talented than I thought. Okay, what I like about the history is I like when uh, King George of the Jungle um, attacked America because George Washington cut down a cherry tree he was going to run into and, you know, it made him mad that he could not run into the cherry tree. Uh, but he didn't know who did it, but George Washington could not tell a lie, so he told him, like, I cut down a cherry tree, so he attacked America. But we were strong and we beat them back. Stupid limeys. Maybe and that's where the band Cherry Pop and Daddy's got their name. Yes. Oh, yeah. Could be. Has nothing to do with virgins and sex. No. Oh. No, that would just make no sense. Anyway, uh, Caliban, what's your favorite part of the history of Independence Day? Well, my favorite part of the history of Independence Day is when the Colonials got onto the ship and threw all of the Indians off of it to steal their tea. Oh, Be yeah. Because everybody knows that India has the best tea. Yeah, that's yeah, why that's true. Except they don't have, do they have oolong? Because I like to say that. It sucks. It sounds it Indian. Oh, you're right, it does. Oolong. Oolong. Mm. Well, anyway, uh, we went, we in Amburu went to wish you a happy 4th of July, Independence Day, um, even though, even if you do wet yourself, um, and it's not really for you, but we want you to have a good time, and God bless America. And God bless those troops that go out there and make sure we have another 4th of July so we can eat hamburgers and drink beer. Yes, we appreciate you killing infidels! Yes. Ura. Anyway, uh, goodbye. Oh, yeah. Thank you for watching the latest episode of The Spew. If you were entertained by our idiocy, then please, I urge you to like and subscribe. If, however, you are furious at our degeneracy and want to send us death threats and hate mail, well, you should still like and subscribe. 
If you are masturbating furiously while watching the spew, the hell is wrong with you? But please, by all means, like and subscribe. If you were, say, whispering sweet nothings into the ears of a corpse after breaking into the morgue, you should probably get professional help. However, before you do, please like and subscribe.